Mana. The forbidden spell. The death knell for this fallen world. Indeed. It rings out again, as once it did for Nazca. Each time this world ends, one cannot help but recall the name of that forsaken land. The name I recall is Shadar, the one whom we turned executor. Bringing an end to this world was his duty, a task to which he was palpably unequal, and I will not even speak of his duplicity. To think he shared a soul with the Savior, and that he hid this fact from us. It seems that mankind has disappointed your radiance yet again. At the last, the Dark Jinn attempted to save this world. To protect the very creatures that first plunged him into despair. I will not be defied. All who defy our will shall perish. The mortal who shared a soul with Shaddaa still draws breath. Should he too choose to defy our will, his reward shall be death, swift and certain. What's going on, man? No! I thought we would be safe here. This place should be beyond the reach of the manor. Can these poor people really be the ship's crew? They've been turned into monsters. <sighs> Time for some target practice. We can. We can't fight these people. What? You'd rather let them tear us to pieces, would you? Leave it to Pete! <gasps> hey! Pete, look out! Please get better. Thank you, bye! Why? 
see me? Did you see that? She cured them just like that. Flippy, Nora. A dot of a thing like her letting rip with a blooming great spell like that. That's amazing. So this is Oliver's imaginary friend, eh? Young, what's her name? B, was it? You mean P? That's me! I'm P! But why is it that we can see her all of a sudden? Ah, well, that's easy. Allow Professor Drippy to explain. We can see her because she's in our world, innit? And Ollie Boy could always see her because she's from his world, obviously. Um, wait a minute. Wouldn't that mean that we should have been able to see her when we went to Motorville? Oh, 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 I have to explain every little thing now, do I? I may be a fount of wisdom, but I got my limits, right? Quite. What we do know is that this girl destroyed the crystal. Clearly, she possesses the power to purify mana. The spell she used, I have never seen its like. It was... miraculous. Miraculous? No, it was Sanctify. Sang i fi Sanctify? So P could return those poor people in Ding Dong Dell to their old selves. Indeed she could. In this channel, you have the solution to this rather unfortunate problem you face. Huh? It's you. You were the one who sent us back to the past. Yes. You may call me Gallus. I am a member of the council that determines the fate. The Zodiacs? The fate of the world? Oh yeah? And what would a busy fellow like you want with the likes of us? I came to thank you. Your power awoke the child. The child? Oh, you mean P? <laughs> I do. Through her, you now possess the power required to purify this world. Sanctify. Sanctify? You mean P's magic can save the whole world? Indeed it can. When you combine your power with hers... It'll do! Ah, young P. At long last, the one you have awaited has come. Yep. <laughs> now we're friends. The time is close at hand. For both you, young P, and for you, Oliver. I wish you well. Goodbye, Doodle Doo!